All right, guys, it is a spooky night at the campground. You can hear the spooky crickets and the spooky birds and the spooky children yelling in the background. And I'm having an awesome campfire here tonight. For any of you who don't know, I live in this big RV right here and I travel the country. If you wanna see where I go and what I do, go over to my other channel called Romancing the States. But for tonight, it is just about to get dark, so I just lit that awesome fire back there, and I have a couple of these pumpkins you might have remembered me buying just the other day over at Michael's Craft Store. These are 8-inch carvable pumpkins. They're made of foam, and I just can't wait. I can't wait. So we're going to carve the first pumpkin of Halloween 2021. Now these pumpkins are foam, so we can't put real candles in them, but I stopped at the Dollar Tree and I got a couple of these other lights. Both of these are battery operated. This one is a little strobe light, and this one here is just like a little tea candle light. I don't know what that sleeve is. I guess you put that over top and it illuminates the pumpkins on there. They just use some AAA batteries. And uh, anyways, let's carve these pumpkins and then we're gonna put those lights in and light them up for Hallow's Eve. With these citronella candles burning, hopefully we won't be getting any bug bites. All right guys, as you can see, we don't have much light here. So I've got these two candles over here throwing the light on our pumpkin. And then we've got the fire burning in the background. Hold on, let me put another log on there. Okay, that is much better. Get that fire stoked up. I've never carved one of these before, but apparently it's foam and it's hollow. So let's see what we can do. I am using a real knife though. I guess we do either have to like cut out the bottom so you can put it over a light or cut the top off just as you would a regular pumpkin because there's, it's solid. Let's see what happens. Okay, that feels weird. <laughs> Holy crap. It's even tougher than carving a real pumpkin. If you do this, be careful you don't cut yourself. Okay, look how thin that is. That's the lid to the pumpkin, and it is hollow, look at that. <laughs> it stinks! Ugh, it, yuck, it smells like plumber's glue or something. Okay, so right here. There's one eye. There's two eyes. Ooh, look at him so far. <laughs> All right, there's the nose. Let's just give this one a big smiley face. It's kind of difficult to carve this thing. All right, there we go. That one's just got a smiley face. And there you go, and the top fits right back on as perfect. All right, let's set this guy to the side and I got one more to carve. All right, one more here. And then we'll put the lights in and we'll set them up. This one's kind of tough. <laughs> I don't know about this one. <laughs> okay. I don't know, guys. Here you go. <laughs> I gave him the big buck teeth. <laughs> All right. 
All right, so here's this one, and here's this one. Let's get some lights in these things and see how they look all lit up. Hmm, okay. There's a little tea candle light. Um, okay, that's what this one does. All right, here you go, guys. Here's number one. <laughs> Look at that spooky guy. <laughs> and here's number two with a little strobe light. Look at that, that looks cool. And here they are together. Spooky. Yep, there we go. There's our fall fire. And here are the spooky jack-o'-lanterns. The first jack-o'-lanterns of Halloween 2021. How cool is that, guys? Now, if you want to get these for yourself, they have them at Michael's Craft Store. And these, I think, were 20 bucks a piece. But if you sign up on their website, you can get a, a coupon that they will send to your email, and you can get them for even cheaper. So, while we're waiting for the actual pumpkin patches to open up, these will do just fine to bring our spooky Halloween to life. <laughs> 